chillin' with Millen. Good day, eh? My name's Mike. This is my channel, Chillin' with Millen. And, uh, I just want to do a, a little pronunciation competition for my friend Dave over at Desmond's Donders. He gave me a list of uh, words here and he wanted to see if I could pronounce them. And uh, funny thing is, they're in Scottish. So I thought I'd give them a try, eh? <laughs> so here I go. True Canadian saying some Scottish words for the challenge for Desmond's Donders channel. Hope you guys check it out. And um, please, please, please enter into the playlist. I'll leave a link for it in the description below. If you like what's going on, just leave a thumbs up and a like and uh, subscribe. That'd be great, eh? So the first word is lock. I'm pretty sure lock means lake, but I'm not sure. But uh, I can use that word in a sentence if you like. Um, went down to the lake and there was a gate to get in and on the gate was a lock. <laughs> okay, so the next one, Edinburgh. Yeah, that's right, Edinburgh. Um, I kind of thought that was more like a, a place too, but we got things over here. We call them icebergs. And uh, they're not edible, so uh, don't be adding a berg. No, okay, sorry. On to the next one. Milngavi. Milngavi is the next word from the challenge here. Uh, Milngavi. I'm not quite sure what that means in definition, eh? But uh, I'm pretty sure the pronunciation is sort of like this. When uh, Mike Milne gets up, he gives his uh, wife a kiss. So uh, Milne gave his wife a kiss, eh? Okay. So <laughs> there, Milngavi. Uh, Garyok. Garyok. I think that's Garyok. I'm pretty sure they do their CHs with a K, so that's the next word. I'm not quite sure if I can use that one in a sentence, but uh, I'll just uh, Garyok with the next word, eh? Uh, the next word is Les Magao. Les Magao, eh? Ooh, that's a pretty good one. Um, not quite sure how to use that one in a sentence either, but hopefully he'll give us a definition for these words later on. Okay, David? That'd be cool, eh? Alright, so the next one is Kind, kind. I think it's a uh, kind of a small word. So the next word was kind, and then there's menzies. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the there's the women's room, and then there's the menzies, eh? And uh, the next one. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like this one. Scone Palace sounds pretty uh, pretty cool place to go. Uh, bet you got a lot of scones there, eh? Okay. So the next one is uh, uh, Folkabers. Yeah. I think that's it, Folkabers. So that's the, the the second to the last one. But the next last one is uh, Findotti. Findotti is the last word that he wants us to say in this uh, pronunciation challenge. But uh, I'm pretty sure I'm saying it right. Findotti. So there's the all ten words. One more time, I'm going to say them from the top. Locke, Edinburgh, Milngavi, Garyok, Les Magau, Kine, Menzies, Scone Palace, Falkabirds, and... F whoop, Fockabers, <laughs> whoa, and Findai. So there you go, eh? That's um, that's all ten words in the challenge. I uh, hope you like this. Hope you uh, hope you uh, um, put your own playlist in, eh? And see if you can do better in this Canadian at saying some Scottish words. And uh, if you liked it, then give a thumbs up, eh? That'd be awesome. And uh, head on over to Desmond Donner's channel and uh, check it out. He does some really great uh, travel stuff with his uh, with his uh, mobile home there. He shows you some really cool cool uh, places in Scotland there. And uh, I really like his channel and I really like this challenge. Thanks for letting us try this, eh? That was a lot of fun, eh? Okay. Thanks a lot, eh? Take off. <laughs> Chilling with Melon.